I do not encourage or condone the use of tobacco or cannabis products, and if you're under the age of 18, you can go ahead and get out of here right now. Alrighty, so today I'm going to be smoking an oregano cigarette for the first time, you know what I'm saying? I really have absolutely no clue why I'm recording this, I gotta be completely honest with you, I have absolutely no clue. But, if I had to guess, this idea sort of came from the idea that some of that good, good kind of thing, when somebody wants to scam you, they just sell you some oregano instead kind of thing. It's that sort of idea, and as such, that's why I'm going to be smoking it, to see whether oregano really can be smoked or not, you know what I'm saying? I think without further ado, though, I'm going to go ahead and get this oregano ci cigarette lit up, you know what I'm saying, and go ahead and actually see how it is. But I think without further ado, let's go ahead and get it lit up. Yes, sir, yes, sir, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? And I do apologize for the noise, you know what I'm saying? I'm at a car park right now, so people do be going in and out, you know what I'm saying? People do be going in and out. But right off the bat, what is my first impression of an oregano cigarette? Well, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. My first impression is, well, pretty negative. It was super rough on the first hit, super rough, way rougher than a normal cigarette. And the taste is not really a good taste kind of thing. You don't really wanna be smoking this taste. It does very much taste like an Italian herbs kind of thing. It very much does taste like something you would taste in an Italian dish, but I gotta be completely honest with y'all, that's not really a taste you want when you're smoking, honestly. I certainly don't want that taste. I prefer the taste of tobacco, but of course, this is not going to taste like tobacco, you know what I'm saying? But overall though, really though, it is surprise surprisingly smoking pretty well. or smoking surprisingly well, however you want to put it kind of thing. I did just roll this like a normal cigarette, I gotta be completely honest with you, I did just roll this nor like a normal cigarette, so it does have a normal filter on there and everything like that, so I'm sure this could be a little bit more potent, but I don't really know, I didn't really look up any of the effects of smoking oregano or anything like that kind of thing, I don't know whether it's supposed to make you feel relaxed or anything like that kind of thing. I know with calendula, I definitely felt very relaxed after smoking that. I have no clue if oregano is supposed to do anything for you, and either way, this is just food grade non-GMO oregano, you know what I'm saying, so there's really not much to it, you know what I'm saying. But overall, this is not so bad so far, and honestly, it is smoking surprisingly well, you know what I'm saying. I really want to do smoking a mint cigarette as well, but apparently it is extremely hard to find dried mint. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. So I just went ahead, bought some mint while I was buying this oregano kind of thing, and I'm just gonna have that on my windowsill drying out for like the next month or something like that kind of thing, and then I'll make that video then, because it is a pain to find dried dried mint in my area, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. But overall, how is the oregano cigarette so far? How is the oregano cigarette so far? Really, it's not bad all, and honestly, Getting a good amount of smoke. There is an absolute, absolute ton of tar coming off of this. There is a ton of tar coming off this. And as we can see, there's a ton of tar coming through the paper as well where it's burning kind of thing. So this is definitely not a clean smoke at all. And honestly, I really don't know whether I'm gonna smoke this whole thing because honestly, the taste is so overwhelming and it kind of just is very disgusting. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. This is certainly not something I would consider a cigarette alternative, that is for sure. Certainly not a good cigarette alternative at all. In fact, this is something I would actually say I never want to smoke again. I don't think I ever really want to smoke this again, and I would certainly never recommend anybody else to smoke this ever again either. But this is definitely something where I'm glad I tried it kind of thing. I'm glad I tried it because I just think it's absolutely hilarious. I mean, like, people be getting hella scammed in, like, high school and middle school and stuff like that uh, for... for trying to buy some of that good, good kind of thing, and then somebody just sells them some oregano. Little do they know, they can actually smoke that oregano kind of thing. Little do they know. It might not actually do anything. It might not get you, it might not get you good kind of thing, but you can smoke it nonetheless kind of thing. So I suppose it ain't a full scam. Plus, oregano be low-key kind of expensive. This was $2.99 for this bottle, so it do be a little bit low-key expensive, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But yeah. The taste is not very good. Calendula definitely tastes better than this. The Calendula was a great experience. I really, really enjoyed that. Super relaxing, absolutely fantastic. This, on the other hand, not so good. I gotta be completely honest with y'all, not so good. An oregano cigarette, I gotta be completely honest with y'all, definitely not really the moves, but something as said, I'm very glad I tried anyway, you know what I'm saying? Something I'm very glad I tried anyway, and something that is just absolutely hilarious in my mind, and I hope you guys find it absolutely hilarious as well, you know what I'm saying? But. Have you guys ever tried smoking an oregano cigarette or anything like that? And if you guys have any herbs you guys want me to try smoking or anything like that, I know mint was on the list. I have mint on the list, as said, but it's kind of a pain to find dried mint in my area, so as said, I'm going to be grinding it out myself. But if there's any other herbs or anything like that you guys would like me to try, feel free to leave them in the comments down below. I think rosemary might be good or something like that, maybe. So may might have to try rosemary in the future. Actually, rosemary sounds like it would taste terrible, i got to be completely honest with y'all. It sounds like it would taste kind of like this. But either way, it might be an experience to have kind of thing, so I might have to see if I can do it, you know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead and take another hit, and this is getting very overwhelming, so I may just have to cut it off after this hit, because this 
it's if I try to chain smoke this, if I tried to smoke much more of this, it might make me, well, maybe not throw up, but certainly make me not really enjoy the next 30 minutes or so while the taste is sitting in my mouth. <sighs> Overall though, very surprising how well this is smoking. Overall though, as said, very surprising how well this is smoking. And I am very happy. I'm very happy that this is smoking as well as it is. The ash is definitely a lot more flaky than it was with when than it is with the normal cigarette kind of thing, which makes perfect sense. This is kind of a different consistency from that. It certainly is a very different consistency, in fact. Uh, but it was honestly, it was honestly pretty easy to roll. It was honestly pretty easy to roll. I did just use my raw self roller kind of thing. I didn't feel like trying to roll by hand with this or anything like that. So I did just use my raw self roller. And I just went like this and just tap, 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 and rolled it just like that. Just make sure I had it all the way up to the brim, and it was all good after that kind of thing. And I do apologize if you guys hear any wind noise or anything like that. It is getting a bit breezy right now. But overall, this is certainly pretty good. This is certainly pretty good for what it is. Still not very good. But for being an herb that people would not normally smoke kind of thing, it's certainly not bad. It's certainly not bad, you know what I'm saying? But this taste, as we're getting towards the bottom, is just getting more and more tarry and just getting more and more disgusting. I would never even want to consider putting this with tobacco or anything like that. This certainly is not something I feel any interest in smoking ever again and is something that, while you can smoke it, I would certainly never recommend you to do so. So I'm going to go ahead, put it out. I am all done with that. I do not want any more. i got to be completely honest with you. I do apologize for not finishing it and stuff like that. It's just absolutely disgusting at this point. I got to be completely honest with y'all. Certainly not a very good taste. The taste right off the bat was certainly not terrible, but this tastes horrible. Horrible now with all the tar getting on there and everything. Tarry cigarettes sometimes are bad enough, you know what I'm saying? And that just is worse. I got to be completely honest with y'all. That just is worse. But overall, what would I rate oregano cigarettes? Are they a yes? Are they a no? They are a solid no, you know what I'm saying? They're a solid no. They are not very good and not something I ever plan on smoking again. But luckily, it wasn't a waste of money to buy this oregano because I was out of oregano at home. So now I have another herb, you know what I'm saying? Now I have another herb. So... I think I'm gonna go ahead and have to end the video here. As said, it's a solid no from me, you know what I'm saying? Oregano cigarettes are a solid no from me, you know what I'm saying? But overall, not bad, not bad. Still very happy that it smoked, you know what I'm saying? Still very happy that it smoked. As said, make sure to leave a comment down below or anything like that if you guys have tried an oregano cigarette before, if you guys uh, have any recommendations for herbs I should try to smoke, you know what I'm saying? But if you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope you guys did, you know what I'm saying? Make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I got my Instagram, my book, my merch, everything in the description down below, you know what I'm saying? Go check it all out. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, you know what I'm saying? And until the next one, stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir, yes, sir, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying?